today we are at Animal Kingdom. Talk so, us through it. Well, basically, Animal Kingdom is a Disney uh, resort. So, last few times I've been uh, here with my boy Arch, That's I've me. been giving it some sort of coaster chat. I've mm. been very measured. Um, today, the Disney effect will happen in about two minutes. So, the next time you see me, I'm going to be fully Disneyed up all day. What, all is, the the what is the Disney effect? Oh, you'll find out. We'll find out. You heard it here first. Obviously, I'll be vlogging my reactions to everything new here. So I've never been to this park before. I've only actually been to Magic Kingdom. Um, so this is a completely new Disney park for me. Everything is going to be new and exciting. I've heard a lot of good stuff about this park. So without further ado, let's go. Also, I'm looking like Bear Grylls today as well. You know, I thought I'd fit the jungle theme. Let's go. You excited? I'm very excited. I'm going to Pandora Land and I'm happy because I need some more charms for my bracelet. <laughs> oh, I get it. I... Honestly, all the feedback from these last two vlogs have literally just been, oh, your family's hilarious. Oh, your family's hilarious. I'm trying to, I'm trying to be funny, man. <laughs> in Kansas anymore. You're in Pandora. Absolutely phenomenal. It was the best so one I've ever been on before it got on it. And then I got on it and it got better. <laughs> I've just come off flight of passage. I'm not over exaggerating. That was the best attraction I've ever been on in my life. I'm a massive fan of the film, so I'm very biased. But the whole experience, and it is an experience from start to finish, immersive isn't even the word. There's not a word that can explain that experience. That was unreal, honestly. I felt almost like I was going to tear up at the end. It was crazy. The whole ride, the whole journey, the fact that you could fly and feel like you're going so fast and swoop through oh nah 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 nah, 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 nah. Oh, I don't see the hype I think it's a, an acquired taste I mean there's only so much time you can be sat on a banshee do you know what I mean? so next up is um, Navi River Journey I think it's called so if you've been watching our podcast on the drop and our main channel for the drop podcast you'll know that this is a low light aqua attraction as we like to call it here at the drop I'll let you know if it's drop approved once we're off. We've got Mummy Nemesis on this one as well, so it's going to be a full squad experience. Stay tuned. Oh, it's brilliant. Yeah. Oh, again, absolutely fab. No, no. I thought it was great. Which is a little bit short. I was expecting maybe a, a bigger experience, but I tell you what, it's worth a long wait just to see that Navi animatronic. I was that expecting was... like a drop with some splashes. Honestly, that some, animatronic. Uh... Uh, a water roller coaster, but no. The, 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 the Animal Kingdom animatronic, yeah. Wow. That, what do you think of that? I really love that. I could have sat on that all day. Yeah, literally. It was really relaxing. To be fair, play me the, the Avatar soundtrack, sit me in a dark room, I'm happy. What is this place? Like, it's sick, it's sick. 
Alright, this one's for Jack, Kieran and Archie. I'm literally sat here listening to some Afro beats. I'm in heaven. Where's Mostak? Mostak? Yo, I might freestyle quickly. I know a few man might want to diss me. No, you can't diss me. I'm in Disney. Animal Kingdom, yeah, can't miss me. I don't know how easy it'll be to get any off-road shots of Everest, uh, but we're heading there now anyway, so I'll give you my full comprehensive review of Expedition. Everest. Here we go, we're on the way to Expedition Everest. Yeah. I know that your dream is to go to Everest Everest Base Camp. So if this is the closest I get, then you know, at least I've given it a go. <laughs> to be fair, we are looking for Everest and cannot see it anywhere. Is it under 18s or <laughs> Oh my goodness me, there it is. Listen, I'm just gonna do it, I'll feedback later. You heard it here first, he'll feedback later. <laughs> <laughs> it was brilliant, absolutely brilliant. I mean, we went up Everest, we came back down Everest uh, fast. I thought it was good. Um, I thought that um, it was scary and I shut my eyes for a lot of it, but it was a good experience. I loved it. It was sick. It was a bit, a bit too many light turns for me. A bit dizzy. Why? Just, just a bit. Is you just hungry? Yeah. yeah. So, we're hungry, so we're going to go grab some food now, but yeah. Wicked coaster, and I'm glad that we all got to ride it as a family, even though we kind of did have to yeah. sort of convince mum to come on. You know what? That was absolutely fantastic. What was great was doing it with the family. Oh. Getting uh, mummy nemesis on that was massive. We oh. pretended that you know fine. you could take your full bag on. Yeah. We said that any, anybody over the sort of 30 centimeter mark was good. Yeah. And it, it worked a treat. It no, worked a treat. It didn't help. No, hey, hey guys, Disney. <coughs> <coughs> that went well. <coughs> wow, okay. So Abby, from the last couple of vlogs, you've got a little bit of backlash from um, your comment about Montu and Infusion. Is there anything that you have to say to that? Uh, what I have to say to it is, um, Animal Kingdom is Bush Gardens. And but what? But it's not. But it is. The only thing that's different is they've put a wham ass mountain in the background of this one. I just speak the truth, I'm humble. I'm just not about to try and share here, I'm just telling you what's what, do you know what I mean? Realist voice in the theme park community. So after about four rides on Expedition Everest, what do we think about it? Flipping brilliant. Disney! <sighs> what are we riding? Gully Rapids. Is it gonna get gully? It's hella gully. Grease! Can you tell I'm giving up on this vlog thing? So we just came off Cali River Rapids and I wish I could do an Arch Deeps and say I'm not wet but I got pretty soaking and in fact I didn't really know what to expect with that ride and um, I thought it was just a normal river rapids yeah halfway through the river just starts disappearing I'm thinking shit I just brought my mum on this and it's about to have some next 90 degree drop but actually it was actually not a massive drop but I found it hilarious because I just dragged my mum on this ride thinking oh it'll just be like Congo River Rapids we are now making our way to BTEC Jurassic Park obviously we're seeing all the Dinodonnies do you want to ask if mum wants to go? No! I don't care about dinosaurs, do you? No, we're going to go over there. I'm sorry, but Animal Kingdom messed up with this dino land. Don't you agree? I'm hot. And the last thing I want is to sit in a dinosaur room. So you bring them, don't you? You bring them to Florida. Yep. You, you bring them to Animal Kingdom. Yep. Uh, what you want to do is you work, you strive for many, many years, in my case, to get... To work hard. ...the family places, experiences, I mean all sorts of different experiences. This is a theme park, we do other things as well. You give them those chances, you give them the opportunity, and what do they do? What do they do? Sit outside in the sun and drink water. Ungrateful. Oh, aircon. I can't be honest, I've come in here purely for the air conditioning. Same. 
There's a thing. Don't really care. So we're here for the aircon. Okay, now let's go get that dino. So we were going to joke about that being a really brilliant attraction just to annoy the girls. It turned out to be a really brilliant attraction. Honestly, that was wicked. <laughs> that was so good. Quite immersive, I yeah. would say. <laughs> that was stunning. Like the final um, Disney. Yeah, the final scare, I guess, uh, with the dinosaur was amazing. Like and air conditioning. Oh, aircon in there was peng. Um, but yeah, dinosaur. I'll give that a solid eight and a half out of ten. What about you? Oh yeah, no, at least a four. What? Out of what? Ten. Eight. You missed out. No, I didn't. Yo, it's the end of the day. It's 97 degrees, so I'm calling it. Um, Animal Kingdom was great. Loved it. Um, see you tomorrow for Halloween Horror Nights. Yes, guys, it's the Arch Nemesis. I can't quite believe I'm saying this, but welcome to Halloween Horror Nights 29.